I'm Cassandra Belinsky for Investment Pitch Media. Thank you for joining us today. Spearman Resources reported its best ever lithium results from drilling at its flagship Nevada property. These results are from the Phase 3 drill program at its 100% owned McGee Lithium Clay Project in Clayton Valley, Nevada, which directly borders Cypress Development Corp. Results from four holes of the Phase 3 program include Hole 15, drilled at approximately 2,500 feet to the west of any previous drill hole, which hit a high of 1,810 parts per million lithium within 537 continuous feet, averaging over 960 parts per million lithium, including 485 feet averaging 1,003 parts per million lithium. Hole 18, the farthest step out hole to the west at approximately 3,700 feet from any previous drill hole, hit a high of 1,760 parts per million lithium within a substantial 652 continuous feet averaging over 895 parts per million lithium, including 455 feet averaging 1,004 parts per million lithium. Hole 17 hit a high of 1,390 parts per million lithium within 170 continuous feet averaging over 862 parts per million lithium, including 95 feet averaging 1,044 parts per million lithium, and hole 16 hit a high of 1,120 parts per million lithium. Frank Bain, director, stated, these results have far exceeded our expectations of what we were hoping to discover on this Phase 3 drill program, in the highest range of any reported drill holes in the history of Clayton Valley, Nevada. James Nelson, President, stated, We are extremely pleased to announce that our Phase 3 drill program has discovered our best results ever on our flagship project, the McGee Lithium Clay Project, in Clayton Valley, Nevada. Given the fact that we achieved strong, consistent lithium grades over massive intercepts on hole 15 and hole 18, and that these two drill holes were the farthest step-out holes, approximately 2,500 feet and 3,700 feet to the west of any hole drilled in previous phases of drilling on McGee, we are confident that these results should increase our resource estimate significantly. It is clear that our next step is to incorporate these new drill results into an updated resource estimate especially when you consider that lithium prices and demand are at all-time highs, up over 900% since the start of 2021. On June 11, 2021, Spearman received the technical report on its McGee Lithium Clay Project, which included a maiden resource estimate of 815,000 indicated tons and 191,000 inferred tons for a total of 1,006,000 tons of lithium carbonate equivalent. Spearman's two other lithium projects in Clayton Valley include the recently acquired Green Clay Lithium Project, comprised of 97 contiguous claims totaling approximately 2,000 acres, and the Elon Lithium Brine Project, which has access to some of the deepest parts of the only lithium brine basin in production in North America. Spearman also has an extensive portfolio of properties in Canada, including gold, lithium, platinum, palladium, copper, nickel, vanadium, and cesium. Spearman's other primary projects include the Goose Gold Project directly bordering Newfound Gold Corp, where Spearman has sampled up to 973 parts per billion gold, and the Peron East Gold Project consisting of five mineral claim blocks covering 11,608 acres located in the Abitibi Greenstone Belt of northwestern Quebec in the direct vicinity of Amex Exploration's Peron property and past producing Normetal Mine. Management cautions that past results or discoveries on properties in proximity to Spearmint may not necessarily be indicative to the presence of mineralization on Spearmint's properties. The shares are trading at 15 cents. For more information about the company and its extensive portfolio of properties, please visit spearmintresources.ca. Contact James Nelson, President at 604-646-6903 or email info at spearmintresources.ca. I'm Cassandra Belinsky for Investment Pitch Media.